Hey, attention crypto gossipators, things are about to get interesting. Remember, not financial advice. Hey guys, what is up? Hope everyone is doing well. Hope everyone's having an amazing day because I am as usual. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back. So here we are with Mockcoin. As you all know, Mockcoin is one of these coins that I covered weeks ago, weeks before we saw this explosion, guys. And this is again, you know, one of my good, good calls. So if you follow me, if you subscribe to me, you will find great, great opportunities to make money because, you know, I'm going for a lot of potential here, right? And as we're going to the bull run, the altcoin season, all that great stuff, we're going to be making a lot of money here. So Mockcoin is definitely one that is peaking. If we open, you know, the coin market cap charts, you see Mockcoin up there. Uh, when you filter out, you know, massive, massive gains, guys, 77% in um you know, a week, that's nearly double, doubling it 12% in 24 hours, maybe by the time this video comes out, it could be very different. But the point is that it is trending and people are discussing and talking about it. You know, if you go on Twitter, people are going as far as saying Mog is the only coin capable of flipping Pepe, this bull run time to Mog harder. Now, I don't know if it can flip Pepe because Pepe, in my opinion, is also a very, very uh, big contender to you know, do the biggest, biggest gains uh, and reach some insane market cap levels. But having said that, guys, overall, Mockcoin looks solid, in my opinion. Now, first of all, what this says is that this thing can move, it can move, right? A lot of you are not familiar with the concept of uh, move when it uh, counts. And that's what it is doing, right? So if you open up the one year chart, look at this, when it saw its first movement, right, that was around March uh, time. As you guys remember, you know, March was crazy. Everything went up. Mog saw a crazy, crazy, crazy increase. I mean, if I was to look at the uh, at it in terms of market cap, um, just went absolutely mental, reached 300 million. Then obviously it went down because as you guys know, we got to take our profits. We got to eat. We got to feel good, right? You can't just keep it in there unless you don't really care about the money. You're just waiting for, you know, uh, the long, long term. But many people, they just take their profits and then they start loading up at these uh, these support lines, which is very intelligent. I mean, if you know how these cycles work, you would understand it. Then again, we see a massive peak, right? Um, massive, massive pump. Again, it drops. People got to eat. People got to take their profits. And again, we are breaking another resistance line. Now, you got to be careful here as well, because when it swings so high up, uh, don't expect it to carry on going up and up and up and up. Right? It nearly hit 700 million in um, market cap. That's, that's crazy. You know, we're going into that billion dollar market cap territory. What I predict is going to happen is probably going to drop you know, a bit because people again, got to take profits, people got to eat, people got to feel good about what they did. It's normal. These are psychological levels. So I don't want to see people FOMOing in at the peak, uh, expecting to, to make money over a night over a week. I mean, that's not how it works, guys. If you FOMO in here, right, then you're going to have to be able to hold until the altcoin season comes. If that is your plan, if you just want to make some profit, you know, make quick profit, guys, this is going to drop and you're probably going to see new opportunities to load up in the support lines. Simple as that. So as of now, what can I say? I am uh, very, very, um, you know, optimistic about this. I've heard people saying this could reach 10 billion uh, market cap. If it does, guys, that's more than 10x, right? That's that's already more than even uh, 15x. Could even say nearly 20x, not 20x, but nearly. So people are saying that it, it will go over 10 billion because everything is going to explode. There's going to be more money than ever. People are going to be going crazy. I mean, even the big institutions and hedge funds and stuff, they're already starting to look at all these different coins. You know, Pepe is very hot, for example. So I don't see any reason for Moncoin not to be. Um, if you guys, you know, are willing to go into something that is quite safe, in my opinion, this is pretty safe. Um, yeah, you are seeing swings. But what I'm trying to say is, is when when it really does count when everything starts going up, that's where you could make crazy, crazy amounts of money. But careful if you're like leveraging and all that. Um, so it doesn't, 
you know, basically drop you out, cut you out, because we might be seeing a big dip as well. It could go down 100% easily and find its new support line before it goes back up when we see that next rally. Either way, guys, you make up your mind. You tell me how you, uh, you're you going to be doing all this. Um, and hopefully you can actually diversify your bag, right? That's the beauty of being able to diversify your meme bag. You know, the meme narrative is hot as hell, but uh, sometimes some memes won't be performing and I don't want you to freak out because others will be performing and you can actually um, take action based on uh, the ones that are performing while others are dropping. So yeah, guys, what can I say? Everything is is really, really looking good. The future is strong. So keep pushing, keep going. Subscribe, turn that notifications bell on. And yeah, guys, big thank you to everyone. I appreciate all the support and I'll see you in my next video. Peace out.